Smith. Season three is on Netflix now. It is Jane Krakowski. You can see her this Friday, June 23rd, live from the Rainbow Room concert series, one night only performance. Sandy Bernhard appears on Sandy Land. Radio Andy Channel 102. You can see her at the Fisher Center for the Performing Arts at Bard College, July 8th. City Winery, Chicago, July 20th and 21st. Uh, you can see Phil at the Sip and Twirl on Fire Island. <laughs> Phil, did you schlep into the city just for this tonight? I did. Thank you very I much. Did. I no, appreciate thank you for having me. Okay, my fun. pleasure. Um, you know what? This is going to be fun. It's game time, everybody. Did you know? Jane Krakowski read for the role of Rachel on Friends, and Sandy Bernhard turned down the part of Miranda on Sex and the City. Is your mind as blown as mine right Wait, now? True, Let's find out what happens when these two talented actors <laughs> vie for some other iconic TV roles as we play Bravo Logs. You both have some dialogue made famous by various Bravo celebrities. Give me your best line reading, and I will award a point to whomever <laughs> I think wins each round. We will start with Bethany Frankel from the New York Housewives. Jane Krakowski with our first Bethany line. Looks like Tom is sticking his dick in the fun dip again. <laughs> Very good. Sandy? The whole crusty vagina crowd is up here at 3 in the afternoon <laughs> dressed in pastels and florals. <laughs> Thank you very much. Next up, we have Giselle from Potomac. Money don't buy you class. Money don't buy you style. And money definitely don't buy you an education, because you can only speak words that are four letters. That's some shade right there. <laughs> all right, Sandy. Becky and all of her good hair ain't got nothing on me, because Giselle has good hair on Thursdays after she gets it done. Hell yes, she does. That was good. Round three, Sonia from New York City. I'm sleeping with Frenchie, and I'm not sleeping with Rocco, because there's guys you sleep with, and then there's guys you marry. <laughs> Sandy Bernhard as Sonia Morgan. What I thought was going to be after 11, leave at 7, has now turned into 7, and he's not leaving until 11. Thank you very much. Give it up for Bravo Logs, everybody. I didn't do winners because I couldn't choose. Back to the phones. Call her. What's your name and from where are you calling? Hello. Hey. Hey, this is um, Caitlin from Kannapolis, North Carolina. Caitlin from Kannapolis? Yeah, I've talked to you before, Andy. <laughs> hey, and did I did I say the same thing? Uh, yeah. Um, oh. Okay. <laughs> Oh, okay. I'll let you talk to her. Okay, <laughs> so my question is, if you were trapped in a bunker Ooh. with a New York housewife, who would it be? <sighs> There's so, uh, who would it be? Who would you want to be? Who could you stand being trapped? Yeah, that's the tricky right. part of this right. question. Uh, who would I want to be? Well, I think Bethany would have the most fun one-liners. Right. So maybe her. Okay. Definitely not Ramona. Okay. That would be a little too much for me. Okay, that would be um, a lot. Yeah, I guess I... And, and plus, Bethany would bring drinks. She'd bring Skinny, Skinny Girl, Girl yes. and popcorn exactly. and dips. Yes, so all I'm going with product. Bethany for the food right. and drinks alone. Very good. Back to the phones. <laughs> Call her. What's your name and from where are you calling? Hey, this is Lisa York. Hey, Lisa, what's your question? Hey, Andy, I just want to say I've been tracking your zit, and it's been looking really good. Thank you. It uh, seems like it's just leaving. It's covered in uh, Didn't she say, didn't my Didn't the artist say that you had a scab on it? She said today. Oh, you saw my Instagram story? But yeah, she was like, yeah, the There's scab scabbing. is clearing up. I'm like, scab? Yeah, I know. You freaked out. I did. I was upset. <laughs> anyway, thank you for monitoring it. I <laughs> appreciate it. Um, um, what is your so question? My question's for Sandra. So, Sandra, are we going to be seeing you and the blender on the new season of Will and Grace? Oh, I don't think so, unfortunately. I don't yeah. think they'll be bringing Sandy back to show her apartment again. Right. You think Sadly. that was a one-time only yeah. thing? It yeah, it was yeah. twice, but... Oh, it was twice, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Last call of the night. Call her. What's your name and from where are you calling? I think it's good to be realistic Hi, in managing Texas. expectations. Um, sorry, what's your name? Connie from Houston, Texas. Hey, Connie, what's your question? My question's for Jane. I was wondering, um, with Netflix doing so many reboots, does she ever see there being an Ally McBeal one? Oh, that's <laughs> a good question. 
Uh, I mean, I mean, it seems like anything is possible. I mean, yeah. Fuller House is, yeah. you know, happening yeah. when they're 50 years on. So there's still hope for my career yet. Oh. <laughs> well, did we? Did we? Was I? I you were on Ellie McBeal. Yes. Uh, yeah. She they wrote a character named Carolyn Poop. And that, and you were Carolyn Poop. Yeah. Is that the weirdest oh thing ever? God. And what? What? Who was Carolyn Poop? I think, I don't know, I guess a lawyer. I think, a lawyer. I think my scene was with you. It, well, I hope you'd remember, but... Um. <laughs> well, it seems that you don't either. <laughs> Neither one of us do. We played Plead the Fist out. <laughs> too, too, too many skinny girl drinks, apparently. <laughs> That's funny. The How, was that recurring, it. Sandy, or was that a no, one-time only? I think, I think it was once or twice. I don't remember. I mean... It was just a few, it was like, I think it was a few episodes. Yeah, yeah, yeah it was. It was a couple. I think, I, I mean, I'm sorry, it just, I, I feel like you represented somebody. Uh, one of the characters on the show, oh. but it, it may have been me. I think it I was think you. I, mean, I, feel like I, I remember somebody for standing like harassment. in an elevator with you. Yeah, yeah, Does yeah. that seem familiar? <laughs> this is really getting weird. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, until they realize um, I don't that think we ever will. Yeah, before they realize that they actually used to be great friends, I want to say thank you to Jane Krakowski, Sandy Bernhard, and Philip from Sipatrol. For more, click on BravoTV.com. Good night, everybody. Thanks for watching. Watch more clips here and subscribe to our channel here. See ya.